Signore, signori. Among blue creatures, special effects, and surround sound, Avatar is breaking box office records worldwide. The script, though, which focuses on imperialism and biodiversity, has already reached the Vatican. Some say the story was inspired by the book Far From Silent Planet by the Christian writer C.S. Lewis. The writer and director, James Cameron, takes the audience to a place called Pandora in the year 2154, where the Navi, humanoid creatures who practice religion, live. The problem is that they're trying to keep humans from accessing a hidden mineral that could solve their energy problems, but in turn hurt the Navi. To gain access to the mineral, humans develop a type of program called Avatar, which produces genetically engineered bodies made to interact with the Navi race. A paraplegic sailor leads the expedition and faithfully discharges his duties until he falls in love. Then a war starts and he must decide between his world and hers. Vatican employees have not been scared off by the film's astronomical revenue figures or the four Golden Globe nominations it's received and instead have criticized the film. Vatican Radio criticized the film's pseudo-doctrines that turn ecology into a religion. Meanwhile, the Vatican's other official media outlet, the Observatore Romano, laments that the film only has a great visual impact scores of anti-imperialist and anti-militarist parable surface without real human emotions, a review that is at the very best lukewarm.